All right, let's see. What do we got here? What is this? Straight out of the thrift store, looking for Paul's Galore. My name is Burke, and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. And man, we are about to go on another thrifting toy hunt adventure. And I am super stoked for it. It is a little before nine. I'm sitting in the parking lot, in the parking lot of old Thrifty Pants, Thrift Giant himself. And uh, I'm about to go in there and see what kind of goodies he's got on the shelves, man. I'm like hoping he's got some delicious goodness, some vintage toys, some action figures, some amazing play sets or vehicles. I just hope that there's something in there that gets me all jazzed up. <laughs> you know me, man, I love that jazz. So, but yeah, we're gonna head in there and uh, take a look around, fingers crossed. And as always, thrift guys, be good to me today. All right, let's see what we got. We got a Spider-Man bowling set. What's down here? Some sort of ceramic doll. We've got 12 inch Spider Man. Man, we see those all the time. What's down here? That's kind of a cool Mickey Mouse. Kind of like that. Might get that. I might get that. And it looks like we've got like these PJ Mask vehicles here. Not a collector of those, really, but here's a some sort of spaceship as well. Hey, check out this vintage talking Mickey Mouse. I don't know what year he's from exactly, but he takes a cassette tape. So it's gotta be from like the 80s or 90s. That's pretty cool. So there's also this Stranger Things Funko Pop Steve and Demo Dog, but it's it's loose. I saw it selling on eBay in the box for about 25 to 30 bucks, but uh, I don't know what it would be worth loose. I didn't see anything listed, so I'm gonna pass on it. All right, well, I guess it was just a Disney Mickey Mouse kind of day. So, all right, so we got this talking plush of Mickey Mouse, like I said. I don't know the exact date on it, but it was, uh, it definitely has a cassette deck in it, which means it's going to be vintage 80s or 90s. So excited for that. I actually saw it selling on eBay for about 30 bucks. Uh, the smaller Mickey Mouse that I've got here, I just got him from a personal collection. That was the whole intent of buying him initially. And then I saw this dude. So I think that's pretty cool, man. So, hey. Next up, we're gonna head to Goody Wheel and we're gonna see what kind of goodies they got on the shelves and hopefully we got some sweet scores over there. So let's head that way and see what kind of goodies they got. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> All right, so let's jump in here real quick. Let's check out Goodwill, see what they got. What you got for me, Goodwill? And then uh, then we'll run across the street and hit up Grace Bridge. Never hurts to try there. Fingers crossed. All right, let's see. What do we got here? What is this? Oh, that's a cool shark. All right, probably pick that up. What else do we got here? We got anything else? Hmm, anything down below? I don't see anything there. Boom Company, some sort of Nerf gun. Any action figures on the shelves? Nope. All right, so we picked up this prehistoric looking shark thing. <laughs> Check that out. He's got like a crazy looking tongue in there but uh so what we're gonna do is we're gonna head across the street and check out Grace Bridge I have no idea 
how much this thing costs, or, you know, I'm sorry, it costs $3.99, but I have no idea what its value is. So I'll have to do a little research. If I find something, I'll throw a little sticker up here so on the screen so you can see what the value is on eBay as far as like what they're selling for, but pretty sweet. All right, so let's head to Grace Bridge next. You know, I have yet to really find like consistent scores at Grace Bridge. I've had one good score here and it was a uh, Cars, a Disney Cars figure. It was worth about 70 bucks. I got it for like $1.99 or something. But uh, last time I was in here, there were a couple of uh, Batman, like 12 inch figures, but I didn't need those, I already had those. There was a broken Darth Vader, didn't get it. So hopefully they got some good stuff for us today. All right, let's see if there's anything on the shelves. I do not see anything. What about back here? Let's go check this. Nope, just this Paw Patrol vehicle. Oh, here's a uh, Incredibles. And, oh, this was from Five Below, they went 99 cents for that. Busted, 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 busted. Man, it's like I always get busted at Grace Bridge. But you gotta stop, cause you just don't know. There could be something on the shelves, you know? All right, let's jump in the car, jump in the car here and do a quick little show and tell. All right, so first up, we got old Mickey Mouse, Mr. Disney himself, right? And uh, if we open this up, we'll take a little closer look. He's got this cassette deck tape, uh, cassette deck holder in his back. So I gotta maybe check on eBay and see if I can find the actual uh, cassette uh, cassette tape that goes with him also picked up this little guy as well and then last but certainly not least we got this prehistoric shark looking thing man it's got a kind of a funky face man it's like almost like uh almost like a human face it's kind of weird i like weird things though look at the size of those jaws man those things will shred you to pieces so man, uh, really cool. So hey, if you're enjoying watching this content as much as I'm enjoying making it for you, do me a favor, smash the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you're always first to be notified of the next episode. Also, like and comment on this video. Let me know of the scores that I picked up today. Which one was your favorite? And give me a follow on Instagram at 80s Toys Rock and Rock is spelled R-O-C! In the meantime, I'll catch you on the flip side.